Hey y'all, it's Billy Hell, and today we're going to look at a Red Dead Redemption 2 location. This is Katora Springs. Now, I rode up the, on this location on accident. I shot a grizzly, and I was trying to find a way to get back to it, and I had stumbled upon this. Now, I'd seen this online, but not personally, and I've got to say I was really taken aback by how awesome it is. The deep blue pulls, and then uh, you'll see in a second, my horse really enjoyed the geysers which periodically go off all over the place so of course this is a takeoff of Yosemite Yosemite uh, in Indian means killer and the Indians that originally lived in this area were so bad that that's where the name came from uh, killer uh, the Mariposa Battalion wiped out all those Indians a long time ago but this place still remains and now it lives in Red Dead Redemption 2 and it is amazing. So you have these pools, you have these uh, around the edges or where the water's come up and dried with the salt. And then you have all the uh, geysers everywhere. And the one thing I wanted to definitely bring up is there are a lot of great game up here. So uh, we have ram. What else have I seen? Elk. I have seen eagles up here. So there's a lot of animals and there's one thing that you need to be aware of. As soon as you're right up in this location, you need to watch out, my friend, because the minute that I was like, wow, what is this? I was attacked by a pack of wolves, and these were King Daddy wolves, and they had to have been legendary wolves. Um, immediately, my horse was down, and then I was on the ground, and I was dead. So if I'd have known in advance to watch out for them, I might have grabbed one and been able to use it with the trapper in some way. So be aware of that. When you go in here, you want to make sure that you have something. If it were me, I'd probably be running a shotgun with slugs. Uh, my big hunting rifle here might be good, but I'd never get it on target in time to be able to get one of those guys. They were literally at the hooves of the horse, and I was on the ground. Also, there are these stack rocks. Now, I know when I lived in California and Malibu, there were uh, formations. They're not formations. These are man-made, of course. And um, you can find these all over the world. And I haven't looked up historically to see if these are at Yosemite or not. I would think that they are if they put them here. So, all right, update on these rocks. These are cairns, C-A-I-R-N-S. And uh, these were originally put up so you could follow trail. And it would be a marker and let you know uh, how to keep on the trail and other things. Um, these would be big enough to be something that would be original to the area but now it's kind of a hobby of people to build these micro uh, versions of this or even big ones, I guess. And uh, those are considered like uh, rock graffiti now. So it's kind of a problem at the park. But I would assume that what we're seeing here, since it's 1899, are uh, spiritual rocks. On with the show. The vistas out here are awesome. This is just one of them. But if you go on out, there are cliffs all over the place where you can see far and wide and uh, you would not want to accidentally ride over the edge. So one more thing we'll do before we get out of here is hit the map. So there's Katora Springs and we're going to zoom out and you'll get a good idea on how to find this place. Wasapati Indian Reservation right there. I haven't gone there yet. I guess I'll go there next. So there you go. This is a Red Dead Redemption 2 location video, and Katora Springs is the place. I'm Billy Hale. Hit subscribe. Let's grow the channel. I'm going to go riding. Thank y'all.